think this music is expressing something that we all feel, that we all have inside. Even people that, that are not necessarily classical music lovers or Bach lovers, if you manage to get really inside this music, it's overwhelming. There's probably no more intellectual form of music uh, as a fugue when you have this one line that's played and then it comes back again and it comes back again at a different level. I mean, it's a very simple way to explain it, but that's basically the, the beginning of what a fugue is. That's a very rational intellectual, as, as intellectual as can be. And still, what he's able to do within there, the freedom that he finds, the, the, the emotions that he, it's, it's what he does with those patterns that, that really, it's, it's, it's mind blowing. I think when we're playing music, we're trying, we're trying to become the music. One should begin a piece of music and, and then just kind of wake up at the end, having become that music, having been one to flow with it. But that takes a deep understanding of, of, of the music. Sometimes we tend to think of composers like, like Bach in very strict ways and, and I think that the fact is that he would probably be more like a modern jazz musician than, than what we think of a, of a contemporary composer in the sense that this was very music that was very much alive and music that they would improvise, that they had no problems making arrangements to other instruments, you know. You know things that in recent times have become more like a sacrilege you know, to, to think of an arrangement. So for him, that was just, it was just making music, you know? It's not uncommon to be playing a piece of music and to, to wish that the composer had written a different note or had done something different or, or maybe this section is too long or it's too short. With Bach, I can tell you sincerely that I have never, I have never ever had that feeling because he's, for all practical purposes, in my mind, he's a, he's a perfect composer. things about music is that you, you can time travel, you know, you can go back to, to, to Baroque times and have communications with this man. And this is this is somebody that you know that, that we as musicians as soloists, I mean we spend you know countless hours, you know, working on his music. And to me it begins and ends as being human, his music. To me that's what it's about. <laughs> 